Experiment 1. Introductory Laboratory Techniques Chemicals and Apparatus Flask Florence Flask L-shaped glass tube Perforated stopper Tripod Clamps, rings, graduated cylinder, test tubes and test tube rack, wire goes, potassium permanganate, separation by distillation. Attach the clamps to each other. Squeeze the screws carefully and check that they are not moving. Attach them to the tripod carefully. Pour 20 ml potassium permanganate solution in 200 ml Florence flask by the help of pipette. Attach the flask to the tripod with the help of the clamp. Put the wire goes under the flask not to heat the solution directly. Do not pack the clamp too much in order not to break the flask. Glass funnel is passed through the perforated stopper and inserted into the mouth of Florence flask. Be careful not to leave space between the stopper and mouth of the Florence flask. Place a test tube to the other mouth of the glass funnel and the system is established. Heat the potassium permanganate solution. Vapor coming from boiling liquid goes into the test tube. Compare the color of substance that is left in the flask with its first appearance. Observe the color of liquid that goes into the test tube. This process is called distillation. Pour the remaining potassium permanganate solution into the waste. Do not pour it into the sink. Precipitation of barium sulfate Chemicals and apparatus Barium chloride Sulfuric acid test tubes and test tube rack. Take 5 ml of barium chloride solution and 5 ml of dilute sulfuric acid solution. Mix 5 ml of barium chloride solution with 5 ml of dilute sulfuric acid solution and observe what happens. Mm -hmm. 
After all solid barium sulfate has settled down, pour off only the liquid part into another tube. Separation of a solid and liquid by pouring off the liquid is called decantation. Pour barium sulfate to the waste. Do not pour it into the sink. Recrystallization. Chemicals and apparatus. Mixture of potassium nitrate and copper nitrate. Determine the tear of a piece of paper, then put about 10 grams of potassium nitrate copper nitrate mixture. Put the mixture in a beaker and add 10 milliliters of distilled water. Stir the mixture with a glass stick for a balanced heating. After all the solid has dissolved, take the beaker from the burner with a wooden toggle. Cool the beaker to room temperature. Then cool it with water. Add water to the completely solidified mixture. Filter paper and funnel will be used. Fold filter paper into four parts and place it into the funnel. Filter the solution. Observe the color and the identity of the solid, solution and the filtrate. 